Three things everyone gets wrong about branched-chain amino acids. The first thing that most people get wrong is that it's pointless to take branched-chain amino acids before workouts. What they don't know is that the branched chains, particularly valine, block the uptake of another essential amino acid, tryptophan, from the brain. Tryptophan gets converted into 5-HT, which you may know as serotonin. Serotonin makes you calm, relaxed, and fatigued. So by blocking tryptophan, the branched-chain amino acids blunt fatigue. The branched-chain amino acids are also used as a fuel source by the muscles during exercise, particularly if you're on a low-carb diet and if you work out intensely. The second thing that most people get wrong about branched-chain amino acids is that they think that if you drink a post-workout protein shake, then you don't need to take branched-chain amino acids as they're already supplied in the protein shake. But not all the branched-chain amino acids from whole food sources get into the bloodstream and used by the muscles. So even if you drink 40 grams of a whey protein shake after workouts, which provides provides about four grams of leucine, you're likely only getting less than half of that, which is around two grams to your muscles. And that's not enough leucine to maximize muscle protein synthesis. The third thing that most people get wrong about the branched chain amino acids is that they think it's better to take essential amino acids, which provide the branched chain amino acids in addition to other essential amino acids. Taking essential amino acids before workouts could actually be problematic as the essential amino acids provide tryptophan. And as I stated earlier, tryptophan is taken up by the brain and converted to serotonin, which induces fatigue. After workouts, you take branched chain amino acids along with a protein shake, which provide all the essential amino acids needed to build muscle protein. 